Hi everyone, this is a real short video. Uh, I just wanted to show everybody how to calculate repeatability. If we look at what repeatability is uh, per the VIM right here, this definition, repeatability of results of closest of agreement between the results of successive measurements of the same measuring carried out under the same conditions of measurement. So if we wanted to look at how to calculate repeatability, it's really as simple as um, taking the standard deviation of, of, of measurements. And if we have trials, and if we're doing a range, we may want to do it for each point in the range. But um, simply here, if we had, say, eight trials and if we a force measurement because it's more house and we do force um, say we did a thousand pound instrument uh, and the device had a resolution of 0.1 so if we looked at repeatability and we made successive measurements you know a thousand a thousand point one uh, a thousand point one if we kept making these measurements and we looked at how to calculate repeatability here, I'm just typing in numbers we may see, see if we put a thousand pound instrument in a dead weight machine. So I took eight measurements here. Um, and if I wanted to calculate repeatability, what I would really do is just, it's as simple as taking the standard deviation. I'm looking for that. Okay, go function that I want that function I'm going to grab all these numbers and effectively right here this is going to be my repeatability uh, standard which is the standard deviation and else we might want to look at is the mean or the average and you can find that in Excel by typing in average and it should work you so you go average the average of all these points is what is 1,000.38. Uh, now, it's as simple as that for uh, single single measurements. However, we want to look at. I wanted to show people some other things. A2LA has this nice spreadsheet right here um, that they did for measurement uncertainty, repeatability, resolution. In their case, they're doing what I just showed you: the mean and the standard deviation that they're showing. Morehouse. Our, our spreadsheet here, our uncertainty worksheet, also has a thing for repeatability because if you have more than one technician or if you're running, you know, multiple multiple uh, tests, this sheet is a little bit more robust. And in fact, we can take repeatability. I'm just going to take my numbers here from this one. We can take between the repeatability between uh, different technicians, which requires a little bit more math here. Um, make a different number, 1,000.3. And what this one will do, same thing, takes the standard deviation, takes the averages, uh, also takes, takes the variance of all these points. And it's gonna give you the repeatability and reproducibility numbers between groups. So. If you want to figure out between texts, um, uh, repeatability and reproducibility between texts, this sheet will do it. Also on this sheet, you might get repeatability because you're, you're dealing with more than just a range. Um, you're dealing with more than just one number if you're dealing with force. Uh, in this situation, we have a half million pound device. Uh, we could go in and we could do uh, repeatability per point, which is you just enter the numbers in here. Um, and we can look at this sheet then, 50,000. 50,001, 50,002, uh, so in this case, we have 50,001, uh, we have 500,000, put too many zeros in, so in this case, you can look, repeatability, same thing as that's being done on the other sheet, except for we're doing it we're in this one we're we're using a we're using a range um, per point so we would do repeatability per point over the whole range and this sheet will show you know different numbers here's repeatability uh, contribution percentage wise so we really have it really is not difficult to do repeatability just the standard a number of tests take the same point 
uh, multiple times, take the standard deviation of that point, and if you want to know the average, you can take the mean of, or average of that point. Again, A2LA has a nice measurement and certainty worksheet that does this for a single single set of parameters. If you want to, if you're doing a force budget, uh, for instance, uh, Morehouse, we have this spreadsheet that will walk you through getting repeatability for multiple points as as well as repeatability between technicians. So that's it. Uh, the other thing I can show everybody is if we look at this, where can you get this? You can go to mhforce.com. If you want our spreadsheet, you can go to support, smart tools, and right here, CMC calculation for force measurements. It is free. Our passion is to help you make better measurements. This is part of our passion. If you have any questions, there's also troubleshooting guides. Uh, there's papers, technical papers are available on adapters uh, and uncertainty propagation for force systems as well, if you wanna know how to do a uncertainty budget for force. So that being said, that's it. Very simple to cal calculate repeatability, uh, repeatability and reproducibility Reproducibility between technicians, uh, as well as repeatability per point. If you want to do, uh, you know, uh, repeatability of a loading range. Thank you.